Fox 13's Hedel Gandhi shows us tonight how this new technology is keeping the airport ahead of the curve. The process for checking your passport just got high tech here in Tampa, and it's all about making international flights a little more friendly. Then just put your hand over top and hold it. It's almost like an ATM. Now it's going to take your photo. With the add-on of a selfie, these automated passport control systems are brand new to TIA. Our passengers have grown on the international front by 43 percent since 2010. Our traffic has grown. Uh, our lines have grown. These machines are expected to cut wait times in half. In fact, a recent British Airways flight with 208 passengers, which usually takes about an hour to process, only took about 30 minutes. And just answer a couple of questions. The system saves time by asking you the same questions as the custom agent. And now it's going to print a receipt for you. Okay. When you get your receipt, you still have to get your passport stamped by the agent before entering the country. But experts say this convenience doesn't compromise security. These are foolproof machines. These machines, which cross-check Interpol and national security databases, cost the Hillsborough Aviation Authority about half a million dollars. Are you Miss Castor? Yes. Please look at the yellow camera. It's money state leaders say is well spent. Every international traveler that comes to uh, this area spends on average $4,500. And that's just one more reason airport officials are taking these high-tech measures to encourage even more international travel to the Bay Area. All right. Welcome home. And you're in the priority lane. Oh, right. Thank you. Excellent. Right now, this passport program is mainly for U.S., Canadian, and visa waiver countries, but later this year, they're going to expand to also include green card holders, which will be huge for travel coming in from Cuba. Reporting from TIA, I'm Hedel Gandhi, Fox 13 News.